Hey, how's it going everybody? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com, and welcome to the update for Friday, April 23rd, 2021. Free play coming up in just a moment. Want to mention a couple of the reduced price packages for the rest of a couple of sporting seasons as we get a little bit closer to the postseason in the NBA and the NHL. Rest of the NBA season, only $399. Rest of the NHL, only $395. And I wanted to bring up the NHL also because we won with the Senators last night and we are now up almost four thousand bucks for one hundred dollar per unit betters with all rated plays in the nhl uh, this season on this current run and i've got a seven star top in play seven star play in the nhl a main event as i like to call them on friday's card now my high-end plays which are rated five stars and higher in the nhl going back to last season we are up six thousand eighty dollars for one hundred dollar per unit betters you can grab the seven star friday side in the nhl on my homepage, docsports.com on friday We'll look to uh, get a little bit closer to $7,000 of profit with my high-end plays going back to last season and including this particular season. I've also got Major League Baseball. We're 11-4 and four and over $2,000 ahead with three and four star plays. I do have a Major League Baseball play uh, on Friday, but I have to tell you that I lost a six-star baseball play last night. We've had a great run. I just mentioned 11-4 and four with those three and four star plays. We got off to a winning start with the six-star plays, and then I lost a six-star yesterday. Uh, had a first five innings under, only one team scored, but they did enough scoring to send it over the total and cost us in that one. But I do have baseball as we look to bounce back, go to 12 and four with those plays on Friday. The seven star NHL main event star of the show. Two plays in Friday night's uh, NBA action. One of those is backed by a 61 and 26 winning spot. It's included in my write up. And also a four star Friday night play in soccer. We win this one, we go up over $5,000 in soccer going back to February 1st. One final note before we jump into the free play. Uh, we won the five-star yesterday at Zurich, at the Zurich Classic, I should say, in golf. Uh, and it was a nice and easy seven-stroke winner. Going to pass on Friday's card. We do think we'll be back in action, though, with round three on Saturday. But a nice way to start off the weekend in golf, winning that five-star play. And also, for those of you who have asked, my FCS football playoff uh, releases will be available Saturday morning on my homepage at DocSports.com. But again, the star of the show seven star play in the NHL enough of that let's get to the free play for Friday we're going to turn to an NL Central Division matchup it is the Reds and the Cardinals and I'm going to recommend to play under four runs it's about minus a dollar five to minus a dollar ten under four runs in the first five innings between these two and you got the matchup between Sonny Gray and Kim going for uh, the Cardinals the lefty who you know had some back problems a little bit earlier during the spring uh, but he had a great Great uh, bust out for St. Louis when he came on board. A very good bust out uh, for St. Louis when he came on board last season. And when I look at the way he pitches, and this has been reported elsewhere, I'm not the only one to bring this up, but Kim's velocity on his fastball reaches maybe 90 miles an hour. He throws a ton of sliders, and I think that's the perfect kind of pitcher, at least to start the game through the first few innings, to go up against the Cincinnati Reds. When you throw a bunch of fastballs at Cincy, they just crush them. They hit them out of the park. They score a lot of runs. Uh, but I don't think that's going to be the case here because he doesn't throw that hard. Also, if you look at the Cincinnati Reds' bats, they had a great start to the season. But the last 10 games, they're averaging less than four runs per contest. On the flip side, Sonny Gray just shuts down three of the bigger Cardinal bats. We're talking about Goldschmidt, Molina, and DeYoung. He's had a great career against those three. And I think they'll be able to hold, or he'll be able to hold the Cardinals in check for the first half of the game. So first five innings play, we're going to eliminate the bullpens here. Under four runs between the Reds and the Cardinals. All right, listen, again, star of the show for me is that seven-star play in the NHL. We'll look to go up over $6,700 on our current run with our top of the ticket NHL plays. If you like the videos, click on that thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe. Do appreciate those who have done so thus far. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com. Let's put Friday in the win column.